In the near future, flying will become cheaper, easier, and more accessible thanks to the innovation of electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft, or simply EV toll. EV toll aircraft are a type of aircraft that use electric power to hover, take off, and land vertically. This technology has emerged due to significant advances in electric propulsion, motors, batteries, fuel cells, and electronic controllers, along with the growing need for new aerial vehicles for urban air mobility that enable greener and quieter flights. Most EV tolls are designed to be small, allowing them to fit into tight spaces. Some are built to carry a single person and are intended to be the ultralight aircraft of the future, so that they can be operated without requiring a pilot's license. Each year, a variety of EV toll aircraft are introduced, and among them, here are the smallest personal EV toll aircraft poised to replace today's ultralight aircraft. Jetson 1. Measuring just 8 feet in length, 5 feet in height, and 3 feet wide, the Jetson 1 is a type of personal flying aircraft known as an EV toll equipped with a 102 horsepower battery powering 8 electric motors that create lift. Produced by Jetson Company, this single-seat aircraft requires no pilot license or special training due to its unique flight computer, which makes flying extremely easy. The intuitive system allows full control over altitude and direction with one hand, making anyone a pilot in less than five minutes. To fly, the pilot must weigh less than 210 pounds, and the aircraft can reach an altitude of 1,500 feet. Powered by high-discharge lithium-ion batteries and eight electric motors, the Jetson 1 can provide a flight time of up to 20 minutes with a top speed of 63 miles per hour. It comes with a charger that can recharge the batteries in one to two hours, and the batteries can also be removed and replaced to avoid waiting for charging. It has a strong aluminum and carbon Kevlar body, a race car inspired safety cell that protects the pilot, can sustain flight even with the loss of one motor, has an auto land function and multiple safety features, including a parachute for emergencies. The Jetson 1 will be available for $128,000, with deliveries starting in 2026. Ziva 0Z2 Measuring 8.5 feet by 8.5 feet, the Z2 is a one-passenger EV toll aircraft that resembles a flying saucer and is produced by a Washington-based company. This multi-planetary look alike flying saucer blends the best features of a multicopter with a streamlined wing for improved range and efficiency. The Z2 transitions from hover mode to forward flight mode, cruising comfortably at 160 miles per hour. As a tail sitter, the Z2 takes off in a vertical position and transitions to a horizontal position for forward flight meaning the pilot starts in a standing position and shifts to a prone position during flight. The aircraft can be manually flown or operated by remote control and will have an autonomous option available in the future. It is equipped with four propellers and four electric motors, providing a range of 50 miles and a maximum payload weight of 220 pounds. Zapata Jet Racer Created by Frankie Zapata, renowned for introducing the flyboard and many other flying machines. The Jet Racer is one of his new vertical takeoff and landing aircraft that resembles a luxuriously cushioned beach deck chair that can fly like an airplane without a traditional lifting surface. This agile aircraft, powered by 10 micro turbo jet engines installed around the seat, boasts a compact size of 6 feet by 6 feet. The Jet Racer is a very fast and highly maneuverable machine with unmatched all-weather capabilities. It can reach speeds of up to 155 miles per hour, allowing solo travelers to swiftly traverse the skyline and enjoy stunning views. The aircraft can reach altitudes of up to 9,000 feet and has a weight capacity of up to 400 pounds. It offers access to steep terrains, can fly in strong, turbulent winds, and can be used as a transport vehicle for objects and materials. 
It has the patented computer-assisted fly-by-wire controls that ensure a high degree of safety while requiring minimal training. Built around a modular carbon chassis, the Jet Racer can fly both manned and unmanned, meeting various civilian and military needs. Zapata Air Scooter Measuring 11 feet by 8 feet, the Air Scooter is a futuristic, one-passenger, easy-to-fly hybrid electric VTOL multicopter made by Zapata in France. Its cockpit features a slightly elongated vertical egg-shaped design with long, high windows in the front, providing excellent visibility. The Air Scooter boasts a cruise speed of 50 miles per hour, a maximum speed of 62 miles per hour, and a total flight time of over two hours thanks to its patented hybrid electric propulsion system. Its fuselage is constructed from carbon fiber composite, ensuring a high strength to weight ratio, and it is equipped with fixed tricycle strut landing gear. The aircraft has a maximum payload of 264 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of over 511 pounds. In the USA, the air scooter can be flown without a pilot license as an ultralight aircraft. It is operated using two joysticks, and the patented computer-assisted fly-by-wire controls ensure the highest degree of safety while requiring minimal training. Alauda Airspeeder MK4 Australia-based Alauda Aeronautics is revolutionizing the EV12 sector with the unveiling of its first crewed flying racing car, the Airspeeder MK4. Hailed as the world's fastest electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft, the Airspeeder MK4 can reach a top speed of 225 miles per hour. This completely redesigned, full-scale, crewed racing hydrogen electric VTOL aircraft is intended for high-speed, low-altitude racing and holds one pilot with a maximum takeoff weight of 2,094 pounds. The Airspeeder MK4 boasts a highly stylized, modern, streamlined design, reminiscent of a modern Formula One racing car. It features a canopy over the cockpit, a low foreplane, a box wing located mid-fuselage, and a rear horizontal stabilizer mounted on top of double vertical stabilizers. Air intake grills on each side of the cockpit cool the hydrogen electric turbo generator. The airframe is made of carbon fiber composite and measures 18 feet in length, 11 feet in width, and 4 feet in height. Powered by a 1, 340 horsepower Thunderstrike hydrogen electric turbo generator, the Airspeeder MK4 features eight ducted propellers housed in four propeller housings, each containing two propellers. Each housing has a 360 degree dual gimbaled capability with the front ducted propellers mounted on the front sides of the fuselage and the rear ducted propellers mounted on the top rear of the box wings. The aircraft is also equipped with fixed skid landing gear. Cyclo-Rotor After more than 10 years of intense research, Cyclotech is now offering the aviation industry a superior auxiliary propulsion technology for the vertical takeoff and landing market with its 360 degrees thrust vector control system. This new aviation propulsion system, developed based on the Cyclogira principle, utilizes cyclorotors operating on the same physical principle as the Voith Schneider propeller, which has been successfully applied for decades to highly agile and stable ships in the maritime industry. A key feature of cyclorotors is their ability to instantaneously direct the thrust vector in a full circle of 360 degrees, unlike other propulsion systems that primarily pull or push in one direction. This unique capability allows cyclorotors to change the magnitude and direction of thrust without tilting any aircraft structures. Cyclotech has successfully developed five generations of cyclorotors, with the latest version showcased in 2021 when they presented a flying demonstrator solely propelled by cyclorotors. Dubbed the Cyclorotor CR42, this system contains several parallel blades rotating around a central axis. Thrust is generated by combined airflow through the rotor, originating from each blade and its periodic change of pitch angle during one rotation. More than 100 flights have demonstrated the technology's viability for flight, although it will still be some time before it becomes commercially available. Rise Recon 
The Recon is a one-passenger electric vertical takeoff and landing multi-copter aircraft developed by RISE Aero Technologies, based in Ohio, USA. This aircraft boasts a top speed of 63 miles per hour and a range of 25 miles. It features six propellers, six electric motors, an open cockpit, and an open-framed fuselage. It is designed for both land and water takeoffs and landings, eliminating the need for prepared runways and enhancing its versatility for customers. The aircraft is user-friendly thanks to advanced artificial intelligence assistance and simple cockpit controls, making it easy to learn to fly. Extensive training is not required, broadening the accessibility for individuals who may have never considered piloting an aircraft before. Ehang's EH-216 Made in China, the EH-216 is a two-passenger EVTOL multi-copter designed for advanced air mobility with a cruising speed of 62 miles per hour, a maximum speed of 81 miles per hour, and can reach an altitude of 9,843 feet. It can carry a maximum payload of 485 pounds to a range of 22 miles and a flight time of 21 minutes. Powered by 16 electric motors and propellers, the EH-216 runs on batteries that take 120 minutes to recharge. The multicopter features a canopy over the cockpit and windows on the doors, providing excellent views for passengers. It has gullwing doors and a fuselage made of carbon fiber composite, offering high strength with low weight and equipped with a fixed skid landing gear. The company states that all studies on this aircraft have been completed, making it suitable for manufacturing and commercial use. Jetoptera J2000 With many air taxi concepts introduced over the past few years, it can be challenging for one to stand out. However, Seattle-based startup Jetoptera has managed to capture the attention with its intriguing J2000 flying car. This hybrid electric VTOL two-passenger concept aircraft features a unique propulsion system that sets it apart from its peers. The J2000 is designed with a novel wing configuration and a proprietary fluidic propulsive system, also known as a fluidic thrust augmentation system. The aircraft includes four hoop-like thrusters, two in the front and two in the back. These thrusters move a small amount of compressed air through the outside air to create negative pressure, which provides lift. All four thrusters are used for vertical takeoff, but once airborne, the front two fold into the body while the rear hoops propel the aircraft forward at speeds of up to 200 miles per hour. This system is much quieter than traditional propeller-based propulsion systems. The J2000 has a predicted maximum range of 200 miles and a calculated maximum altitude of 15,000 feet. The cockpit features a canopy for excellent views and gull-wing doors supported by hydraulic shock gas struts. The fuselage is made from carbon fiber composite, providing a high strength-to-weight ratio. Its projected empty weight is 1,600 pounds, with a maximum payload of 400 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of 2,000 pounds. SkyDrive SkyDrive is a single-passenger aircraft designed and developed in collaboration with Toyota to provide flying services in densely populated cities around the world. The company aims to offer this aircraft as an on-demand air taxi bookable via a cell phone. After booking, SkyDrive would safely and autonomously fly passengers to their destination. Officially unveiled in January 2022, it can carry a single passenger. It boasts an approximate cruise speed of 25 to 31 miles per hour and a maximum flight time of 10 minutes, though the company expects improvements in speed and flight time by 2026. Measuring about 13.1 feet in length and width and 6.6 .6 feet in height, SkyDrive can fit into the space of two parking spots. The SkyDrive aircraft had its first public flight in August 2020 at the Toyota test field, where it flew for about four minutes. This event was reported as the first flying car demonstration in Japan.
Lift Aircraft Hexa. The Lift Hexa is an all-electric vertical takeoff and landing single-passenger wingless multicopter aimed primarily at tourism and short-distance travel, developed by Texas-based company Lift Aircraft. This ultralight multicopter is designed to be amphibious and capable of landing on both land and water. It features 18 independently controlled propellers and 18 electric motors mounted on a motor strut assembly, resembling a web of six inward pointing sectors with 12 outer and six inner electrically powered propellers. This configuration allows for precise control by varying the individual motor speeds and provides excellent visibility for the pilot. The aircraft has a cruise speed of 45 miles per hour, a maximum speed of 63 miles per hour, and a maximum flight time of 15 minutes. It employs semi-autonomous piloting and stability achieved through flight control computers. After training in Lyft's virtual reality simulators, passengers can operate the HEXA using a single three-axis joystick or engage in autopilot mode via a small touchscreen. It comes with lots of safety features, including three redundant flight computers, three redundant sensors, and collision avoidance sensors. If the pilot releases the joystick, the aircraft will automatically hover. It can also automatically land in designated safe areas or be controlled remotely by lift-trained safety pilots. The vehicle can fly with up to six motors disabled and is equipped with an autonomous ballistic parachute. Lyft Aircraft is selling a limited number of hexes for $495,000 to buyers. Xpeng AeroHT Voyager X-1 The Voyager X-1 is the fourth-generation single-passenger autonomous VTOL multicopter aircraft developed by Xpeng Motors, a leading Chinese all-electric vehicle and technology company. Unveiled to the public for the first time at the 2021 Shanghai International Automobile Industry Exhibition, this production aircraft is now available for purchase. The Voyager X-1 can be operated by a real-time command and dispatching center. The passenger sits in an open cockpit, with the fuselage forming a high wall behind the seat as a safety feature, similar to a roll bar. The aircraft has an approximate maximum speed of 81 miles per hour, a range of about 25 miles, and a cruise altitude of around 1,640 feet with flight time between 35 to 45 minutes. Constructed with a carbon fiber composite airframe and aviation aluminum structure, the Voyager X-1 features fixed skid landing gear. It is equipped with eight propellers and eight electric motors located at the ends of four booms, positioned at a 45-degree angle at the corners of the aircraft. These booms can be folded into the fuselage or removed for easy transport and storage. Designed to be the size of a car, the Voyager X-1 can easily fit into a garage, driveway, or standard parking space. It comes with lots of safety features, including distributed electric propulsion, multiple redundant systems, spherical environment detection, autonomous return and landing, ground monitoring, real-time video, an omnidirectional camera, and an emergency ballistic parachute. Xpeng Motors envisions the Voyager X, one being used for advanced air mobility, sightseeing, search and rescue, public services, and more.